All right with you. Welcome to another video here on the channel. In today's video we are going to talk about PDF. This extension is widely used, so much that if you search the escape, has several components there to work with this type of extension. However, I will bring here today one that I found. Found it very interesting for the ease of its usability. Only with one container aid, we managed to generate one PDF file. If you want to know how it works, I'll explain after the vignette. Let's go! Here we are so our dear for it. And this is the component I said okay. It as it is written down here. Just pass. That he. Make one PDF. Let's go then. Do this okay. I have here one fully blank application. I will create one new page. Will be called home. I'll do it the simplest way possible, okay? This is what I'm doing. For example, you could use for if you had a customer table of employees finally wanted to print the data of a certain person. Use IED is to create a specific container for this and print create PDF reports. Okay, at last, I could do a lot in a very simple way, which is what you will see, but I'll just do it right here as basic as possible. Okay, I'm going to drag the container, which is the main one here, which is the element only. that we're going to have on the screen, basically it's. I'm coming here to manage dependencies, and I will call so to speak. Our extension is I will write here PDF is this one and df button select him and gives one a play now that i already have here what am i going to do he appeared down here i will expand and i'm going to drag it here it's only one block simple like this it's just that it's one little button you can modify it okay i can leave this here said print i can write something else i can put inside an icon modify the cs here but let's go here the way it is okay here's our container i will put his name is my app ready container name is my app and here are these two errors which is container a he needs to map and fail name this one I will put. My app also puts my app. My app where you put extension is good PDF point. Ready now everything I put in here. Be one image. It's one text. Anything I put here. He will appear. When give the print, it's good. I will do one thing. I'm going to make a little cut here. I'm going to get some text and I'll be right back here. We're back so I have it here now. Copied. A text Lauren and. Inside this container I'm leaving. Come here at Widgetry. I have an app here. Inside that container. I will put here. It's the other container same. I will drag it here. And here inside this container. I will put one text and i will paste into this text everything i copied as you can see here is a giant text ready he got it all stuck up all messed up but it doesn't matter what i want to show you is the following for example here's what you say what will he use to map for printing is that first main container Everything you have inside, it will print let's say I want. 
It's here inside this container. Is to split this here into two columns or three columns. It doesn't matter. All this is possible. It's good. But what I'm going to show you is this. It's already working here. It's good already. If I go Ollie and give one ups and show this. No browser, it will work. So here for example. I have no margin up. Not even to the Neither side. Neither for the other. So if I print it this way. He will print. Obviously, but go. it's all glued, all tight. So whatever you want to adjust. For printing go better, come out more centralized. Not stick to the edge. You put here in this my epic. In my case, it's in the main container that you put there. Here for example, I will put one margin just for you to see okay. I will put a top margin. The XXL ready it came right down you see. I will publish here. You let's see in the browser. Working printing. We are here now in the browser. I'll come here and give you a print. As you will see, automatically it went down. And here is my pdf.app, which was the extension name I put. I will open. As you are seeing up here, he gave that margin that I put. But the sides, this here is chaos. To solve this is the same thing. Return to your corporate service. Here I print it just to show it's good. But I will put here. Is. Left and right for you to see the difference that we'll get. I will put here now. Margin pair there let me come here. Margin. I will place one liter. And I'll put I'll even copy this here. Right margin. And I will put one margin here. Ready. I'll give you a pause. And let's see now the difference in printing. So we come back here to our browser. I'll come down here and I'll give you a print again, okay? Now you will see that what was glued is no longer so much. As you can see, it's not difficult to format. For being inside a container, we are already used to HTML formatting. The margin asks for a jam, so using these CSS concepts, we managed to create one document. PDF has a lot of difficulty mapping. What we want to print. Let's talk like this. If you are not subscribed to the channel yet, sign up. Activate notification bell and of course, like this video to reach more people. See you in the next video by then.